So here's the van. Um, as we were talking about, you're gonna see they just push and hold this. The door's gonna open up. The ramp will come out. The van's gonna kneel down so it gets a little lower. Makes the angle a little easier. And you are seeing the van exactly the way I traded for it. So please look past the dirt, but uh, just let you know, of course it'll be clean from top to bottom. Uh, you do have the nice rubber floor inside, so it's non-slip, a little easier to keep clean. Uh, leather seats. Uh, you're gonna have power doors on both sides, plus a power hatch in the back. We'll get to those in a minute. Um, you'll see this button here, this button here, this button here, and actually the button on the roof, along with the remote, will all do the same thing. Uh, you'll just see, push this button, everything's gonna come back in. Door will close. So all of that can be done manually. Obviously you can open the door if you need to, the ramp if you need to. You can just see, uh, as I put it back out, you'll see there's a handle right there on the end. You can just grab it and pull it out. So you never have to worry about being stranded somewhere because something's not working. You'll see that handle. You just grab that handle and pull it out slowly. Uh, that's your manual way to operate in case you're an accident, battery's dead, anything like that. Uh, you'll see you do have a chance for seat here and here. We're gonna jump in those in a minute and turn them around. Uh, nice thing about this van, no sunroof, no DVD player, so you use all the height that you want. Uh, this is what's called an XT, so it's taller inside than the average. It's about four inches taller. Um, uh, this is going to be your uh, seats are all really, really nice shape. Uh, definitely looks like a 20,000 mile van. Uh, you'll see we do have front and rear air conditioning. I'm going to go ahead and start it up. Let's see, 25,000 miles on it there. Uh, do have a backup camera that's going to be in here. We'll get to that in a minute. Um, you have an on and off for the meal here. Uh, cup holders, these, every one of them breaks, but that will be replaced. Uh, there's a little spring inside here that comes loose and we have to fix on almost every single one of them But that's one of the things that we will fix uh, You'll see your transfer seat here I'm gonna Go backwards You'll see come all the way out. I know you're familiar with them Put this one up rotate around And rotate back here rear hatch the tires that are on here are decent but they're old because of they don't put any miles on it so it will have a brand new set of tires on it um, I don't sell anything that the tires are over five years old so those will get replaced um, uh, as you can see, they had an ugly carpet back here. <laughs> so uh, you do have power back here. Um, the van does have a dent right here. We'll get that repaired. Uh, this little bit of scratches and everything like that, all that'll get repaired. Uh, also have a little scratches right here. Uh, all that'll get repaired and repainted. Uh, power on this side. back down kind of typical with these uh, all power windows power mirrors traction control do have bluetooth on this one along with your radio controls cruise control uh, this one's going to have your transfer seat on this side this this will probably come out they just stuck it in here it's 
doesn't work with your transfer seats. So, uh, you know, uh, unless you say, hey, David, leave it in there, I throw these away because they just don't work. You have your transfer seat. Oh, this way. Ah, that's why those don't work. They're just in the way. Um, you do have a foot rest back here for both sides. At one point, the van had um, an easy lock in it that's been taken out. At one point, it had hand controls. Those have been taken out. And I'll take the rest of this out of here, too, because I don't have the rest of it. But all of this will come off. They just removed those. Uh, the person that had it before could drive for a little while, but then got point where they couldn't. And uh, so they took all that stuff out. And I'll, um, again, 25, 8, 12 on the miles. Close up both doors. See there. And that one's already closed. And I'll, um, otherwise, I mean, the van needs a good cleaning. Everything seems to work on it. I have not gone through my shop with it yet, but I will. Uh, just walking around it, as I said, I can tell I'll put tires on it. We will uh, obviously change the oil. We'll go through anything we find that it needs that low mileage you run into every now and then having things that are uh, a little bit uh, dried out or whatever because of that. So, but in general, um, brakes a lot of times will replace because again, what you get is when they sit around a lot, brakes will get rusty. I just replace those. I'll give you a full list of everything we did to it. Everything, uh, you'll get copies of those receipts and everything. Um, but it will be a very, very nice, 20,000 mile van when I get done with it. Uh, it's just going to be uh, the basic van SE. So you get a little nicer wheels, you get a little nicer interior. Uh, but in general, uh, you do get dual power doors and power hatches. The LEs don't have power hatches where the SEs do. Uh, but any questions at all, anything you want to see better, you can figure it's going to take me. Uh, You'll see this here. So this whole rear bumper is going to get painted because we've got some scratches on this side, got scratches on the other side. So we're going to end up painting the rear bumper, the rear hatch. So, but it will be very, very nice when I get done with it. So thank you, ma'am.